This is another rare and discontinued um, Hasbro toy I've had that I really liked playing with um, when I was little. Um, it is really cool. And I believe this is pretty old. And it's got one of their old brand, one of their old brands um, logos right there. You see it right there? This is My Little Pony on it. Which I loved My Little Pony when I was little. And this is one of the old logos. I think this is a past generation of one of my um, childhood shows. And I'm now in my teenage childhood. I'll show you this toy. So, things to know about the toy. Um, um, like some of like some of the features. Who makes the toy? The recommended age and the price range. So, all right. So back here, there's the batteries. Um, I don't know what kind of batteries this take. There's like a ribbon in there. I'm not sure why that's there. And what year is this from? And I believe it says it right there. Let's see. 2008 Hasbro. So I believe this actually came out in 2008. And it is 11 years old. So 11 hands on children. 11 years of hands on, hands on of children. So here's some of the features. So. This is a really strange button that like okay, so let's um see this this part. Let's see if I can get it open. Oh, there, there, there's there's just some of my other stuff right there. My other collectible stuff. Those those two are not Hasbro, those are Spin Master. If I can get this thing open. Oh, Oh, get open. Oh, this thing to. Oh, there we go. All right, so, and it it opens up like that, and I believe what comes with it. Um, this is like a like a little. I think this is like a little tray that, um, but, but this color of muffins did not look like it. Um, did not look like it, but it normally does. So this moves, this goes down like that. This door opens like that. And then up here we have this goes into the bedroom. I don't know what that um looks like. If you know what that um like some symbol. If you know this reminds you of any discovery any um old school um discovery family character, let me know down and let me know down in the comments below. And it um has these really cool um, prints on here, which is really cool. Hasbro did a really good job making this product. And then over here, there's a balcony, and this door like opens. You can close it back up. So, okay, so um, there's just like these stickers right here, and it's really cool. Those flowers right here. And there's like this little swirl right here. And then there's this button right here. I'll show what it does. So when you press it. So. It does like light up. Let me show you again.
So, some people would say this toy could kind of get on. Not all parents like this toy. Not all parents like this toy. Like a stove right there, which is really cool. And then, I just have like some of these other collectible stuff. Other, other Hasbro toys. These are ones that you can find in stores today. These are Lost Kitties, and those are not Hasbro. They are Spin Master. I believe they are Paw Patrol. And this button right here, it, this is... If you don't like loud toys, do not watch this video. If you don't like loud toys, you can choose to turn off the video at, that, at this time. It's this button. Hmm, what it do? Oh god. So you as a parent, like this is gonna be the most annoying Hasbro toy I've ever seen in my life. It's just it's, ah, ah, ah. So probably the come on, will this thing ever be quiet? This toy does not have a on off switch or a volume control which is like which is really um would get on the nerve to the parents and it would really hit on the nerve of the parents and the siblings and the and the older si the, the older siblings like it would really get on which of the parents and the siblings I know and, yes, so this is from 2008, yes, it is from 2008, so this toy is 11 years old, like I said before. So, so now we're going to talk about my, um, th my ups, my ups, my ups and downsides about this toy. Okay, so, the ups... Um, the ups about this, my, my good side of, of this toy is that kids will have fun role playing and coming with their own, um, Hasbro stories, their own fun My Little Pony stories. And my other plus my other good thing about this toy is that um you can is that I'm trying to think of another thing is because that the oven sound is so realistic. And my downsides about this toy my downsides, um, about this toy is, um, this toy does not have an on-off switch. Another downside is, um, show you. That button right there causes this repetitive song. So, it would probably get on a little bit of the nerve of the parents and the older siblings, I believe. It is just super, like, annoying, cool, and annoying. So I would give this toy a 9.5 out of 10. So, I do, will, I will, I do give it that. It's because, um... My sister, um, Pipsqueak and I, we actually had a lot of fun with this toy when we were little. And now we're, um, 13 and 14. So we're teenagers now. And we still love Hasbro. And they're a pretty good company. Their toys are so cute. They, they don't look too obnoxious looking. So if I had, um, the grand, if I won the grand prize on AFB, I would buy all these, I would buy all these Hasbro toys and Spin Master toys. 
and Spin Master Toys and Spin Master Toys. So, um, back in the 2000s, you would see this probably at Target in the children's toys area and in, in the children's toys in the children's toys section. Probably like in the girls section. That's where you would find this back in the, if you were at Target, um, back in the 2000s. So, if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe. Please subscribe. Leave a comment. Like. And turn on notifications. Turn on notifications so you don't miss out on any videos. And I still... Alright, so I cannot believe my channel has reached 10, over 10,000 views. We still have, we still have another, we still have, we still have another goal to get to. We need to get to 120 subscribers. I believe that's the goal. I believe, I believe the subscribe when people subscribe, it's still getting to its goal. So if you have any questions, place them in the comments. And I will try to reply to every comment you leave, every comment you leave. Only nice comments only. Please no swear words. Please no... Please no inappropriate profile pictures. So the profile I would choose I would do like cute profile pictures, funny, cute, funny, educational, action, adventure, heroes, villains, Disney characters. I would love it. Just I would love to see all those profile pictures when you leave comments. I cannot wait to see them all. So, if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe, leave a comment, like, and turn on notifications so you don't miss out on any videos. And you know when new videos are uploaded, like this one. And... We, um, love to share videos with others around the world. And I'll see you next time. So if you have any questions, if you have any questions, um, place them in the comments. And see you later. Thanks, guys. Bye-bye.